it is very important for you to download the right zip file. Get the Mac OS 1 if you use Mac. If you use PC, make sure to download the Windows zip. Go to Edit, Preferences, Add-ons and click Install. Find and select them tree zip file and click Install Add-on. Lastly, enable the add-on by checking the box. Place your mouse cursor at the top right corner of the viewport. When your cursor becomes a plus, hold left click and drag your mouse to your left. Change your editor type to Mtree. Hide the side panel while pressing in and click on the new button. Creating any type of tree should start with adding a tree measure. Press Shift A and go to Measure and Tree Measure. The next step is adding a trunk and connecting it to the measure. You don't have to click on Generate Tree button. As soon you modify any value, the trunk is going to appear in the center of the world origin. Adding and modifying branches is also very simple. Additionally, you can add and use a radius override modifier that works best when connected after the branches. There are as well two properties, random value and ramp, which can be connected only to gray dots inside the branches node. I tried to combine both properties since they are having gray connectors on the left side, but I was getting no results. Add leaves with just one click and control all the settings inside the Modifier Properties tab. You won't be able to add custom leaves, but there are still many options for you to play with and tweak. Here are a few tree examples and each of them with a visible setup. Some models may require manual editing in order to fill the missing faces. Thank you for watching.